Well, good evening, everyone. It is Mr. Sunshine coming in live, reporting here from Palm Beach, Florida, as things are unfolding here. That's right, things are unfolding here at Donald Trump's Mar-a-Lago. Uh, we just got report that it is under siege. It's under siege by the FBI. Uh, they, from what I understand, uh, they have seized the compound, the Donald Trump Mar-a-Lago, and uh, we're actually pulling in right now. Julianne Harris, good evening, uh, Mr. Sunshine, reporting live from Palm Beach, Florida, where things are taking place. That's right, things are taking place here in South Florida. Uh-oh, here we go. This is what's happening here. We've got the police out here. We've got them out here on the Southern Boulevard Bridge. All right, things are happening here. As a matter of fact, there's the police. They're keeping, they got a lot going on here. As a matter of fact, people are standing out here right now, getting a load of what's going on. There's Robert Abramson out there. He's standing outside. Well, we're going right in. That's Mr. Mr. Sunshine Locksmith Eddie is going right in over there uh, to Donald Trump's Mar-a-Lago. And uh, we're going to see what's going on here. We've got the gates locked up. Uh-oh. They've got the signs out there. This, this uh, service entrance is, in fact, closed up. Uh, we're going to come around the bend. United States of American flag flying high right here at 1100 South Ocean Boulevard. The billionaire, billion dollar property. That's right, it's worth one billion dollars. That's right, most expensive home here in Palm Beach. We've had Ken Griffin, $500 million homes, properties. Well, here it is. This is it, Donald Trump's property here. The police are out here. We got it all going on right now. Oh boy, here it is. They've got, uh, they got the signs out here, which are always out there. Uh, we've got people here. The C Secret Service right here. Uh-oh. Oh, boy. They've, oh, shit. They've got the machine guns out today. There, it's all happening there. Uh, they have, the FBI is seized mar lago They're here at my, uh uh-oh, there's people over here. Oh, boy. So they have, from what we understand, people, the FBI is in Donald Trump's Mar-a-Lago. Uh, I don't know. They must have a warrant to get in. Uh, they're going to make his life as miserable as possible for not to vote. Matter of fact, we're going to turn around. We're going to turn around and come back around to see what's cows and all. Look at this. Billion, million dollar. Oh, these are $30 million mansions here. I shouldn't even be pulling in here before the FBI calls me up. All right, we're talking 53 billionaires, millionaires from around homes, $210 million properties here in the town of Palm Beach. Uh, this is 1020 South Ocean Boulevard. Uh, Donald Trump is 1100 South Ocean Boulevard. So let's take a look here, see what's going on. We've got it all happening. Here we are, right on the ocean. Uh, we're going to see the Secret Service out here, or the FBI, all right? They're standing out here with the guns already drawn. The guns are out, so they're seizing Mar-a-Lago. So there's a lot going on. Nobody knows exactly what's going on, but here we go. This is it right here. Uh, as a matter of fact, this is Al Woodbridge. There's Woodbridge. There's Algoma. And then right, oh, there he is. There he is. The police, there he is. Oh, look at the machine guns. He's got the machine guns out there. Oh boy, there it is, Donald Trump. Uh, you can see some people behind the wall back there. They are inside the mansion. All right, you've got the camera systems out here. You've got an underground tunnel. Underground tunnel, we just drove over. As a matter of fact, I filmed that tunnel. You can see that on YouTube. All right, uh, Eddie Shippick, Mar-a-Lago Underground Tunnel. It is all going on down here. Claude, as a matter of fact, we've got the, uh, this is the service entrance side of Donald Trump's Mar-a-Lago uh, right here. This is service entrance over here. Uh, they have the sign. That's all blocked off. That's locked down. We're actually going to come over here and pull over the side of the road. 
Uh, I saw um, we've got Robert Abramson over here. There's the police. We got the police over here. Oh, we got a couple of them here. Oh, boy. This is what's going on here. This is what's happening. I don't know if I'm going to find a parking space. Oh, we got two police officers here. Oh, boy. We got it all going on down here. Things are taking place. Oh, things are taking place. Oh, this is bad. This ain't definitely, it ain't good. I can tell you that. When the Palm Beach police have to take a back seat to the FBI, you know it ain't a good thing. So what we're going to do is we're going to ease on in over there. We're going to ease on in. There's Robert Abramson. He's standing there looking as old as he can look. I don't want that cop coming down here. He's going to write me a ticket. There's Robert. Hey, Robert. Things are taking place. There we go. We got, here, say hello to everybody. We're live. We got uh, 20 people on there. What's going on here? Do you know what's going on? We've become a banana republic, I think. That's right. That's right. The FBI is now seizing Donald Trump. That's right. They seized Mar-a-Lago. Let's get outside here. I'm going to leave the motor run in case they come over here and want to kick me out. As we are coming to live right here, as a matter of fact, we just, we got to watch the police because I don't want to get stuck. All right, what you're looking at right here is Donald Trump's Mar-a-Lago, 1100 South Ocean. Are you filming? I don't want to interrupt you. We are, but it's uh, no audio. No, no, no. It, it, it's just, it's just, oh, perfect. It's just, okay, yeah, okay. We're coming to live right here at 1100 South Ocean Boulevard. This is the billion-dollar home originally made by... Um, Meriwether Post for the Post Serial in 1922. Uh, it was then vacant and Donald Trump picked it up for about 10 million bucks. It is the billion dollar home, which was right now is under siege by the FBI. As a matter of fact, this is what's going on. So Kathy Gray, we got everybody on Zach Zuck. Let me tell you, look at that Zach Zuck. You know, Zach, let me tell you something. You know what you could do with what you're talking about right here? Huh? Right here. You understand, love it or hate it, learn to live with it. Apparently, you're not living in a billion-dollar home. You don't live in Palm Beach. That I can guarantee. We got Zach Zuck there, the traitorous orange bastard. Yeah, but but we can talk about, we can sit here and talk about Joe Biden, all right? You're probably giving uh, a circle jerk to Hunter Biden in his computer, right? They're probably between the watch and the porn and everything on, on Biden's skin, but that's okay. No doubt. No doubt. No doubt about it. But this is what we got going on right here. He is live on the hey, there he is. What's going on, Schrader? You know, where's the Lamborghini with the eyes wheel? They, the FBI's over there. They got it under siege. Oh, boy. It's a bad scene here. Bad scene. As a matter of fact, uh-oh, here we go. All right, you take care. Hey, buddy. There it is. Oh, we got the Palm Beach police. What, was he waving or was he giving us the finger? No, he was waving. He's waving? Okay. We're, we're good. We thought you were waving at him. Yeah, okay, good, good. Scott Schrader's here. All right, so what we have here again, to recap, we have the FBI. The FBI has seized mar lago over here, Donald Trump's Palm Beach mansion, the billion-dollar home. Hainsworth. Hainsworth, uh, yeah, look at that mook. You see what I'm talking, you see a guy like Jack Zuck. You know, I don't know if it's Jack Zuck or is it Jack Suck. Either way, it makes no difference to me. You know, I love guys like you. I love you because it's losers like you, obviously a Democrat, because if you're a Democrat, you really suck, all right? But what we're gonna do for Zach, you know what? I'm going to play Houdini right now. You want to see how I play Houdini? I'm going to pull sure. a magic trick. You see, we're going to take Zach Zuck, the mook. We're going to click it, and we're going to block him right like that. Now you see him, now you don't. You, Just like that. That's how we get rid of the losers like Jack Zuck. <laughs> All right? You don't need Houdini. You got Mr. Sunshine here. But here you have it. This is it. I'm telling you what, Sandra Hart, I know what you're talking about, Bob Santor. Uh, we are here live at the billion dollar home of Donald Trump, uh, president, uh, former president, the 45th president of the United States of America. And uh, as we sit here and bringing it to you is only 
Mr. Sunshine can right here in the town of Palm Beach. Uh, you got your Democrats out there, you know, they're, 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 they're sucking up to the idiot Joe Biden and uh, they're, they're sending uh, the FBI over here to try anything, anything to get Donald Trump from running for president again, okay? They're spending trillions of dollars. They're weaponizing the FBI and the government. That's right, you're next. As a matter of fact, I know what they're gonna do. They're probably in there looking for the, the um, list of members, all right? They're looking for the list of members of the Donald Trump Mar-a-Lago. Um, I believe there's 500, it's either 500 members or 800 members. They're probably trying to get the list to, to go through every single one. As a matter of fact, I called, I called my buddy here that lives right next door. Oh yeah? Yeah, and he was watching it on television. I said, well, let me tell you, don't be surprised they come banging on your door, all right? So Trump they said they already went into it safe. Yeah, they're already breaking into everything over there. That's right. They're already breaking into everything. There's nothing. That's going no, there's to nothing in that safe over there. Believe what? Yeah, Trump's going to leave his stuff here. He's up in Bedminster living a good life. You think he's going to leave anything down here in Mar-a-Lago? He's dreaming. But this is how desperate the FBI and the Democratic Party is, okay? They're all a bunch of losers. They refuse to go after Hunter Biden. They don't want to check Joe Biden and the Chinese connection and the millions and millions of dollars coming in. They only want to come after Donald Trump. And the, the sad part is Donald Trump, he wasn't even aware how deep the swamp is, okay? With the FBI of all the Russian collusion, they couldn't make find anything in that. But now they're trying everything. They're even coming to his billion-dollar home just to think, nah, Teresa Clark, there ain't no tax thing. Um, if that was a tax thing, the IRS would be there, okay? You would have the Internal Revenue Service agents conversing. This is a federal uh, investigation where I'm sure Biden and the, not even Biden, it's the idiot, it's the people that are controlling. Biden's merely a puppet that's standing there reading off the teleprompter whatever they tell him what to say, all right? But the fact of the matter is, when you've got an inept president, yeah, we're talking live. You want to say hello to everybody? We're live on the Facebook feed, huh? We got beautiful, no matter where I go, beautiful women. And that's real, grab it. It, it doesn't come off. Go ahead, pull it off, pull it off. They don't pull it, ain't that beautiful? Huh? Do that one more time. Do that one more time. I want you to do that one more time. It's so beautiful. It is. I'm like a dog. You know, when you pet the dog, he starts running. That's me, Mr. Sunshine. That's Eddie's locksmith. Come here. 693 8636. For the best locksmith. No matter where I go, beautiful women are sure to be around. You see how gorgeous she is? I can't believe you're able to get so close. It's not a protection. I actually drove, um, no, once you get over, no, it's all walled in. I was actually drove in the front of it. They had the guy with the machine gun. There's a guy with a machine gun, the FBI yeah, he's agent. Outside. He's standing out there with a gun, dude. I mean, come on. It's Stephen Malaret. Stephen, this is what's going on here. We are at Donald Trump's Mar-a-Lago. It's under siege by the FBI as we speak. Uh, I'm actually going to drive back around there. Again. You want to take a little ride? Sure. And I'll drop you off. Sure. Come on. Let's take a little ride. We're going on location right now. We're going on location. We're here before the press. That's right. We're here before the press. Ah, we're here before the press. Here, you wanna, you can, we'll slide the door. You can put that camera in. I'll drive you right to the front gate. All right, we'll put you right to the front gate. We're going on location. All right, so let's go. We're going to take this thing for a little. We're going to show you exactly. You got your camera going? You got to turn your camera on. You want to go live? We can do a dual live it's video. Matt, MAGA. MAGA. Yeah, MAGA. MAGA. Yeah, that's right. He got a MAGA license plate. Custom plate for Florida. All right, so we're going to take a little ride. We're going to take you right on location. All right? Forget about CNN. I don't even see Fox News here. Sean Hannity lives right up the road at Sloan's Curve. He ain't here. It's me and the man. The ladies, get a load of this handsome devil, huh? That's all mad right there. Well, let me tell you something. <laughs> all right, so Locksmith Eddie... And Mr. Robert Abramson are on the move right now. And we are going to bring it to you as only Mr. Sunshine can. All right, there's 
I've been going here for about 20 something years. Uh, Jules Brassner was a member. I used to drive him and Rosie here for years. Uh, and then my buddy Bob, he's a member, which I was, I was actually there uh, well, a few months ago before they closed. All right, so we are here at 1100 South Ocean Boulevard. You could Google that and see the magnitude of the Mar-a-Lago mansion. It's uh, a billion dollar property. It's one of the most expensive property in Palm Beach. Uh, the second one would be Citadel Hedge Fund Ken Griffin with $500 million for the vacant lot of just right down the street here. All right, so here we go. This is what we got going on here. Here it is. They've got uh, the FBI agents are inside right now. All right, there's the gates. There's the main gates. There's the police. Here's the police right here. There he is. Oh, there he is. They got, oh, look at the machine gun. You see that machine gun? They got the Uzis out there. Oh, boy. There is, I bet you those are the H&Ks. Is that the H&K MP5 or something like that? Boy, I think you're right. I think M it's MP5. Yep, MP5, Heckler and Koch. All right. We're going to go down here, Algoma Street. As a matter of fact, we're going to turn this thing around. We're going to go back around here. South Ocean Boulevard via Palma. Look at this. Look at this palace. Look at this home, huh? This is about $55 million. All right. You're looking at a $55 million mansion right here. Direct, And they got an underground tunnel. Underground tunnel takes you right over there to the ocean. You got your camera going on? I'll wait for you. You you going live or are you just doing a video? No, just a video. Okay. There's the ocean directly across the street. There's Magic Jack, the inventor of Magic Jack's former mansion Look right there. The cars. Look at all the cars. They're all coming down to see what's going on. It's all over the news. It's all, oh, there goes, there goes uh, my dear friend's wife. There she goes right there. Oh, yeah. yeah. Oh, boy. She's actually turning down her street. She lives down there. All right, so we're going to come down here. We are here. This is it. You're not getting this anywhere else. You're not getting this on Fox News or CNN. You're getting this. Look at the helicopters up on the roof. You got the helicopter up there. Huh? That might be the FBI helicopter. Oh, boy. They got aerial helicopters up there now. Oh, boy. There's a lot going on. Now, they can land in the backyard if needed. They removed the helicopter pad. All right. This is part of Donald Trump's. Home. These are the guest homes here. There's the sister's house. There's the police. There, oh boy, look at the machine guns. Oh boy, MP5s, Heckler and Koch's. Oh, there's the President of the United States, American flag flying high. There's the pool houses over on the other side there. Our underground tunnel, we just circled around. It's completely walled in, camera systems throughout the whole thing. You wanna drive through again? It's up to you. Yeah, we'll circle around, we'll go around again, and see what's going on. And then we'll go back, we'll go one more time. Hey, I got my parking spot down there. I'm good. Yeah, you're good. You're good. Look at the helicopter up there. Oh, my. There it is. Take a look at that chopper. Now, we don't know if that's FBI. I don't know if that's uh, CNN. I'm sure CNN's foaming at the mouth right now. CNN is foaming at the mouth. All right. They're dread. And those Democrats, just like that idiot that I had to get rid of. Another loser. All right. But, you know, you can't keep a good man down no matter how many women jump on you. You know what I'm talking about, Robert? <laughs> they can do everything they can to try to do to Donald Trump. It's just not going to happen, okay? It's just relentless. That's how bad they're terrified of Donald Trump. All right. This is his family. We're right here in the middle of it. Me and Robert Abramson are in the middle of it. There it is. Look at this guy. He's standing out. He's probably wondering what the locksmith fan is driving back and forth. Oh, yeah. Right. He's not taking his finger off that He trigger. ain't taking a finger off the trigger. No. He's not taking that finger off the trigger. No way. So we're going we're gonna to cut down here. Oh, boy. Everybody's doing this. Everybody's getting terrified here. This is what's going on here. This is bad. Look at brand new mansion going on up over here. This was the Woolworth five and dime home, all of it. This oh, all yeah. belonged to the Woolworth uh, founder. They built this. It, it went from the ocean all the way down, all the way down to the uh, Intracoastal. It was the same size as Donald Trump's Mar-a-Lago. 
But uh, look, these people are circling around too. Oh boy. So we're going to turn ourselves around down here, okay? This is... My dear friend lives here. That house is about 12, 15... No, I think it's 15 million for this. Uh, he might be approaching 20 million on this screen. These are some brand new homes. These are 20 million dollar and up mansions here. Uh, one, one, look at that. Look at that spectacular home. Take a look at this home right on the intracoastal. Look at that, right on the water. Oh, dude, you're talking. Oh, that helicopter's up there. They're uh, they're doing. Look at it. They got the helicopter lights on up there. Oh boy. And Lot Smith Eddie, we're on call right now. If they call and say get in here, I I, I opened the safe this morning at the yeah. school district. That was no problem. Ran to Hialeah. Look at that. Oh boy. I ran to Hialeah in Miami today to work on some stuff. So yeah, if they, if there ain't nothing in Mar-a-Lago that I can't open, okay? We got all the tools, and we've got the ace in the hole, Robert Abramson here, okay? Take a look at these spectacular mansions here. I'm telling you what, you're talking about a lot of money. Look at this, we got this guy out here. He's watching what's calls and all this. All right, so we're gonna go back. We're gonna make one more round, and this will be it. So all right, so. Keep your eyes peeled. You're getting it live, not from Fox News, not from CNN, but right here from the Sunshine Media Group, all right, with special guest Robert Anderson, okay? You should stop and interview these guys. <laughs> yeah. yeah, when they point that at the business end at us, yeah, we're going to be moving away real quick. Oh, look at the FBI out here. FBI is out here. This is what's happening. I know. Don't worry, but look at him. Wait, wait, like, what are you doing? Fuck you. You see what I'm talking about? You see how these fucking guys are like, well, I'm not allowed to ride. Now, the FBI is going to tell us we're not allowed to ride up and down South Ocean Boulevard. Is that, I, I should stop and question him. Okay. What, what, is there a problem? Yeah. Is there a problem? I'm not allowed to drive back and forth here? Huh? Fuck. You see what I'm talking And you know, he's a Democrat. I can guarantee that FBI idiot was a Democrat, okay? And when he comes banging on my door, it's not hard for me to find and he's locksmith with the home number plastic. Yeah, waving his hands like, oh, the fuck you. Yeah, everybody got the camera. Yeah, but he, look, look, here's the film crew here. All right, they got all the film crews. Go oh, look, they got the film crew down here. Oh, boy. They're setting up camp here. They're setting up. This is what's going on. Oh boy. Oh, they're interviewing these guys. Get out of the way. All right, so let's, let's go out there. Let's pull Eddie Locksmith right in front, See that? <laughs> in front of the backdrop. Right in front of the backdrop. Oh my, here we go. This is what's happening here today. What a, what a view. This is what's going on. The Democrat, and we got the helicopter up on the roof overseeing. Now, whether that's a news or it's an FBI helicopter overseeing the operation here. But for to recap, we are here at Mar-a-Lago under siege. The FBI has raided Mar-a-Lago. Uh, they're probably, they, from what I understand, I heard uh, they opened up Trump safe in there. Uh, I'm sure he doesn't have any money in there, but I'm sure they're probably looking for the members list. Uh, the members list of Mar-a-Lago, uh, I would imagine, would be there. And uh, they're probably trying to get anyone anyone that has any information and uh that's what's going on here so yeah they're all walking across it we got film crew over here they're interviewing that guy we got a big film crew down there as things are taking place but you know what there's only two people here that know the game better than anybody and that's mr sunshine and the big Robert Abramson. Okay, you understand what I'm talking? You see that? I, I still can't get over that FBI guy throwing his hands up. Like, did I, did, did I miss that? Yeah, yeah. He, he went like this. Like, what are you doing? Yeah, 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 yeah. Right get here. Out of here. Right here. I hope the FBI guy's watching because he can be doing this right now. I swear <laughs> to God, it's unbelievable what's going on here. All right, the Democrats have gone insane. All right, the Democratic Party have lost their minds. Uh, right here in South Florida. They've they've been insane for the last six years. But here we go. Yeah, 
Oh, I saw him. Yeah, he, he, he's like, yeah, what are, what are you doing? Like, who are you? Who, who is he to tell me we're not allowed? I didn't know his name was written on South Ocean Boulevard. I wasn't aware that he owned the front of Donald Trump's Mar-a-Lago. Because if he did, they would have shut the whole entire street down. All right, they would have shut the entire street down. But uh, there you have it. This is what's going on here. That's right. He shouldn't have done that. The guy's got a bad attitude. I, I should go back there and challenge him. <laughs> with, with, yeah, I'm going to give him the finger when I go by when he has that MP5 in his hand, that H&K machine gun. Yeah, let, it, let him pull that out. It's just unbelievable. Look how, look how clear this picture is. There we go. This is what's going on down here. This, look how clear. You're getting a great view uh, of the, uh, that's the pro shop there for the tennis courts. Right there, tennis courts are right behind it, and then the main mansion is behind it. A billion dollar property. That's exactly what we have there. 1922, built by Meriwether Post from the Post Serial heiress, built that home. And uh, her vision was when she passed away to leave it for dignitaries from around the world to enjoy it. Well, she left it to the state of Florida. They couldn't afford it. Uh, they turned it around. They were going to actually bulldoze the house over. Until Donald Trump brought it in and took care of it. So there you go. There we go. There's another one. Here we go. We got another one. Surrounded, surrounded by Democrats. We're so surrounded by Democrats. Listen to this fucking idiot. Uh, look at this. This is typical. It's typical. You know, <laughs> it's typical. Low information. It's typical. That's it. This is what's going on here. Yeah. See, that's the thing. Democrats don't want to talk about the Biden crime family. They don't want to talk about Hunter Biden. They don't want to talk about inept idiots that have to read off of uh, teleprompters because Joe Biden is an incompetent fool. They love incompetent fools. All right, Democrats love incompetent fools. Anybody that can lead, they don't want to hear it. That's the way it's going to be there. So you can see what's going on over there. So there you have it. There we go. So there we go. And, and right in the middle of it is yours truly, Mr. Sunshine. Okay. There's Mr. Sunshine in the middle of it. Yeah, he's Jada. Yeah, the, the FBI is over there raiding his house. Uh, he's actually in Bedminster, New Jersey, at his golf club mansion up there for the summer. Uh, there's actually just a skeleton crew here maintaining the maintenance, and the Secret Service is here uh, guarding the place throughout 24 hours a day, seven days a week. But uh, the FBI is there today. I, I think the helicopter is left. I think the helicopter left. Uh, they were here on the scene earlier, but uh, that's what we got going on right now. So, to recap, we're going to tune that up there. To recap, there you have it. There you have it. So, you're looking at one of the, uh, well, Ken Griffin, Citadel Hedge Fund Ken Griffin has the largest vacant oceanfront lot, uh, $500 million uh, that he bought, and he's actually building a home for his mother on part of that. So by the time it's done, it will be well over $1 billion. Uh, what you're looking at right now is a billion dollar property. This is the most expensive property in the town of Palm Beach at $1 billion, uh, belonging to Donald Trump. So. Uh, this is what's going on. That's right, Elaine, they only want another free check. All right, that's the Democratic way. Democrats just looking for something free. All right, as a matter of fact, we're sitting here, Mr. Sunshine, and you know, I feel, I feel safe. 
with him standing here, okay? We could sit here and talk about all the bullshit, all right? But there it is. That's what we got going on right there. There's some Trump supporters coming down there now with the flags. There we go. That's right. United the States way. of America. There comes the reinforcements. The reinforcements cavalry. that the cavalry is coming. That's right. They hear that one guy run his mouth. Those guys will stomp it. They'll do some stompage on there. So here we go. We got Trump supporters out here. There it is. We got some film crews down there. We've got uh, news media over there. There you go. You can see. I don't know what. Can you see the name of the news media that's down there? Is it uh, WPTV? WPTV? Yeah. WPTV. Yeah, there you go. There you see it. We got it all going on down here. This is what's happening. So to recap, the Democrats, the Democratic leadership has gone insane to the point that they're going to stop at nothing to stop Donald Trump from running for president, okay? They love Biden. Here's another. Look at this vet truck coming in. Look at this. We got a big Jeep coming in here. United States of America. That's right. Now you know he's a, he, you know he's a Republican. Democrats hate America. That's that's the fact. They love socialism. I right. They love the communist. There you go. So we got reinforcements coming here. You got Make America Great down there. But uh, for those of you joining us, there it is. Mar Lago, Donald Trump. The billion dollar home 1100 south ocean boulevard bringing it to you live right here in sunny south florida al piccioni al we're coming to you live here's big al big al you got mr sunshine and a big robert abramson here huh you know you know what i'm talking about <laughs> we just need al piccioni right here we'll put al right here al to bring you up to speed, we're here in Palm Beach, Florida, uh, looking at Donald Trump's billion-dollar home. That's hey, Al, you know you should come down here and buy a beautiful home. We got him here. It's, uh, most expensive home right now was on a market for two hundred and ten million. Uh, the one that just sold for one hundred and seventy-three million dollars. Oracle, Oracle CEO, bought it off a of Netscape founder Jim Clark, who bought it off of the Zip billionaire property down in Manalapan. It's a big, huge ocean to lake for, two, uh, for $173 million. But uh, right here, you're looking at a billion dollar property, which would be 1100 South Ocean Boulevard, Donald Trump's mansion. The FBI, are they're seizing the property. They're, they're in there, it's under siege. Uh, we understand they went in and is that what they said? They went in and broke into safe. Yep, they went. They went in and broke into his safe. Statement. They went on. A, they went in safe because I know what they want. They want. They want the members list. They want to see if there was any Russians. Russian members. Okay. They're they're they're, they're so desperate. Okay. They look like foolish. That's right. They're they're uh, raiding his place. He's not even here. Trump's not even here. He's up in Bedminster, New Jersey, but uh, they came here. Uh, well, I'm sure they got a warrant uh, from some liberal or Democratic judge, another loser uh, of the Democratic Party. But uh, that's right. Well, let me tell you something. No, they wouldn't want me because I'm pro-Trump, okay? I could have had the safe open in 30 seconds, but uh, you know, <laughs> you know <laughs> I, just like I had the one at the school district this morning open. I had that open in 25 seconds. The woman's eye the woman's eyes got so big, she couldn't believe what was going on. Here's big John Garofalo. Garofalo lives right up the road here. He lives right up the road. So there you have it, the good doctor. All right, so there it is. Uh, we're going to get ready to head on out. We're going to shut down here. They're going to be going on. To, I don't see any. There's not, they're not going to be out here. Can you a picture of your shirt? In the backyard. Yeah, sure. There you go. Only if I'm in it. Yeah, you got to put him in it. I'll move this out of Not there. you. You didn't dress <laughs> for the occasion. Thanks. All That's right, awesome. my friend. Thank you. There you have it. Nope. So, yeah, let's go see what's going on down here. So we're going to take a little walk down here. We should be all right there. Locksmith Eddie. Uh, 
on location. We're on location here in South Florida, right here in Palm Beach, Florida. Uh, it's Donald Trump. Uh, FBI is under, Mar-a-Lago is under siege by the FBI and the Democratic Party. Democrats are, yeah, do you remember when uh, Frankel, remember when Trump was president, Frankel, she badmouthed Trump, but the night he had the party, she hid under the pillow. You're going to be begging. You're going to be begging. How dare you come like a like a that's that traitor? I'm born and raised here, woman. I've been here my whole life. That man came to the Democratic Party. He separated the Democratic Party. The Democratic Party. The Democratic Party. Listen to these seat Democrats. When they don't have gold, when they don't have, when they don't have Rolls Royces, they get all. They, 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 this is what we're talking about. Typical, typical Democrat. They hate everything. Okay, they hate America. They hate capitalism. Here we go. There we go, Darren. There. there we go. <laughs> the cavalry has arrived. <laughs> oh my God. You see how that. Even know what it's for. You see how, Oh, it's beautiful. You can see it in action here. You can see how the Democratic hatred, the hatred of the Democratic Party. Aaron Linksman, we're here live down here in South Florida as Mr. Sunshine's bringing it to you live how the Democratic Party really is. I mean, they're hateful. They're, they're evil, vindictive. That's the way it is. Capitalism doesn't rule with Democrats. Socialism. They embrace Bernie Sanders. They love, they, they couldn't get the Russian collusion to work. All right. They lied all the way from the FBI down. All right. But what you have right here is what's going on. Hey, how you doing? It's a beautiful day today. No question about it. You can see the hatred and the animosity toward the way the Democrats act. And that's the, you saw it. This isn't a staged, this isn't staged, this is live, all right? You get to see it live. And they can't stand to see a billion dollar property. They can't stand to see success. They can't stand none of it. They want that socialism. They want that free monthly check. They want to sit there and have the government feed them. They don't even want to go to work anymore. They want to sit at home and collect a check while the rest of us are working. Then to hire more IRS agents. There's some more Trump supporters coming in here. There's another one right there. He's driving down the road. You got it all going down, down here in South Florida. This is what's happening. You got the Trump supporters down there. You got those Democrats still down there. The Democrats are still down there acting like the clowns that they are. So there you have it. You've got a good view of what's going on. Aaron Linksman, we've got FBI agents out there with machine guns. They got the machine gun uh, out, uh, strapped to there with the finger on the trigger. Uh, we drove back four times. Uh, they weren't happy. They weren't happy to see Mr. Sunshine drive back and forth. Uh, showing you what's going on hey al let me tell you something Al. when you're talking about the mr Sun, you never know what you're going to see you when i turn on that camera we could be at hard rock we could be at trump's mansion having dinner i was there at the halloween party party and dancing till dawn okay that's the way it's going to go now big al you know big al mr sunshine can have big al picayone down here as a special guest we bring a few of your signs all right, bring some of those as a backdrop. As a matter of fact, you know what I'm going to do for you right now? I'm going to show you how it's going to go down. Okay, I'm going to show you that right now. All right, here we go. This is it. All right, coming to you live right here in sunny South Florida. we got Eddie Slotsmith, Mr. Sunshine. Coming to you live right here in sunny South Florida. Now, imagine it, Al. A couple of your beautiful signs hanging here. We'd have them in the backdrop. We'd have you in a chair, glass of champagne. And you can tell us all about how rare the sign is we can get a couple of your buddies on there to vouch for what you're saying and how rare those masterpieces are and then maybe we can come up on location up to your museum 
the Picayone Palace. Ha! Huh? We'll come up to the Picayone Palace and get a load. I'll turn on that camera. We'll do a whole big video, a whole thing of uh, what's going on on what a museum is supposed to look like, okay? As a matter of fact, we're even gonna put a little ticket machine out front where you gotta you got slide a credit card in for admission charge or something. Okay, you understand what I'm talking about? Uh, you know what I'm talking about. There you go, that's right. They gotta go back to the mental ward because let me tell you, those Democrats are going crazy down there. They're going crazy. You see how crazy they are? They're gonna come to blows. They're, yeah, they're, they're crazy. Those Democrats, they, they show they're relentless. They want that socialism. They want that free check. There's no question about it. There you have it. Should we go ride by one more time, see if he stops us? Sure. All right, we're good. Let's go. We're going to pay out. Hey, Al, we're going to ride by. The, the FBI threw his hands up because he was a little upset for me riding back and forth four times. Well, you know what? Until he shows me he owns, so I own, I actually own four condos down the road here on South Ocean. Okay? I don't think he owns a place in South Ocean Boulevard because if he was, he wouldn't be standing out there working for the Democratic Party. Okay? You understand what I'm saying? He wouldn't be standing out there. So we're going to go right now. We're going to go back on okay. We're going to show you a billion dollar mansion. Now, Al, you got to come down. We'll get you a condo down here. We'll put you up here on Front Street. Let me turn this on. There we go. Democrat. That's right. They're on Democrat. Oh, you should have seen these women down here. Oh, they were crazy. Here we go. We got Trump supporters out here. You got film crews out here. What the hell is that? Listen to this. Look at this. Look at this. <laughs> Kid Rock. We got Kid Rock. We got Trump supporters over here. We got, we got it all going on. Look at this. We got it all going on right now. Channel 10. ABC News is here. You got ABC News. They're all here on location. But let me tell you something. There's only one news that you're going to get, and that's the sunshine media. There we go. Let's go, Brandon. That's right. Let's go. There you go. So we're going to go ride by Trump. We're going to see if he's going to throw his hands up in the air again. All right. He wasn't too happy with Mr. Sunshine Locksmith, did he? Riding up and down there, getting a little view of what's going on. It's okay for the FBI to come. Here they come. Here comes the whole crew right now. Yeah, yeah, she's gonna go get the finger. Yeah, she's the psycho. She's the Democratic psycho over there. All right, so here we are. This is it. Pay attention. This will be the last time. Well, we're gonna have to come back. But this is what we got going on. This is Trump's mansion right here. One billion dollar property it's the mar-a-lago club all right it's walled in over here you know when when meriwether post owned it there was actually broken bottles cemented to the top of that wall they had broken bottles glass bottles cemented to the top so people could not climb over that wall well they took that out uh, back in the 70s they removed the broken glass bottles that were cemented up there. All right, so we're going to come back around. Uh, you can Google 1100 South Ocean Boulevard, so you can get an aerial Google view of Donald Trump's compound here. It goes right to the ocean, to the intercoastal. That's what Mar-a-Lago stands for, ocean to lake. Look at this. Oh, boy. Look at this. Oh, my. We've got it all going on here now. They've got the place... Look at this. The lights are on upstairs. You see the lights on up there? Huh? They got the lights on in that second floor up there. They're seizing this property. They're seizing the billion-dollar Donald Trump mansion here, the American flag. They had a ter You know, Amer Democrats hate that flag. They're probably seizing it because they hate that flag. They don't want to see that American flag flying high here at Donald Trump's mansion. Look at this. We got the police here. Everybody. Traffic's getting blacked up. All right. Look at this. We got it. Oh, look at this. We're, oh, boy. Here we go. The cops are everywhere here. Cops are everywhere. The place. Oh, look at this. Film crews. Look at this. They got the film. I didn't even know you were allowed to park up here. FBI. Yeah, look at this. The, uh, the Secret Service. Palm Beach police are here. Secret Service. There's the Secret Service. There's the FBI. Oh, my. Listen to this. They Look, they got the film crews out here. Jesus. Oh, there he is. There he is with the machine guns. There he is. He got the machine guns. 
in the check right there. Oh my God. Oh, you make one wrong move, you're gonna get shot. Yeah, can you imagine getting shot by that machine gun? Huh? Look at this, they're all walking over here too. They're all walking over here. The place is crawling. The place is crawling with FBI agents. <laughs> oh, Jesus Christ. Oh, shit. As a matter of fact, you know what we're going to do? I'm going to show you what we're going to do. We're going to get out and get some action here. Huh? If ABC can get out there, if ABC can get out there, well, guess what, Mr. Sunshine? Hello. He's not too funny either. Nobody coming out of here, right? All these driveways have sensors. Look at that brand new fucking mansion over there. We're gonna go. We're gonna go walk over there. We're gonna go. Now that everybody else is walking out there, if we were out there by ourselves, we'd get fucking uh, arrested. Look at this. They're all filming. They're all filming. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. Oh boy. We're gonna pull right over here. Yeah, we're pulling it right over here. That's where I'm going. That's where I'm construction. Let's go. Yeah, you better lock it up. Let's go. We're gonna listen to that fucking fuck music. It's a carnival. Oh my god, this is like a circus over here. So this was the vacant lot. Uh, my my uh, former broker sold this lot right here on South Ocean Boulevard and uh, what's this out? Woodbridge, I believe. And uh, I think you got like nine million dollars for this. It's actually right across the street, next door to Mar-a-Lago, Donald Trump's property. And here we are on South Ocean Boulevard. Now, any other time, you would not be able to do this at all. There would be nobody standing out here. Secret Service throws you out. Well, the Secret Service isn't here right now. Secret Service is sitting back while the FBI is tearing Mar-a-Lago apart inside. They're breaking into safes. They're, look at this. It is a, it is a shit show down here. It is a shit show. Look at this was the, how this house, you know, Robert, this was the sister's house. It's actually for rent for 225000 a month. For 225000 you can rent this house right here. Not for sale. It's for rent. Okay. Look at this, everybody's out here on Trump's property. Oh, Jesus Christ. This is a real shit show here. Look at this. This is a shit show. Look at this. Look at the police. Oh, boy. They've got the Secret Service out here. They've got the FBI. Look at the machine guns. They've got the machine guns out here. Look at this. Film crews. This is what's going on here today. Look at this shit. Oh, Palm Beach police is back up. And I'm, they, they never let anybody stand out here like this. Never. Look at cameras here. Look at camera systems. They can zoom in. Police are everywhere. There's the Secret Service over there. That's an undercover Secret Service vehicle right there. Uh, the SUVs, Palm Beach Police. Look, there are more police here. They're probably going to tell everybody to get out of here. Oh, my. This is a real shit show here. This is a real shit show. Look at this. Yeah, for sure. For sure. What they did to our president. Don't hold the filming. Why are you doing that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Look at all of this. I'm right on. Boy, the word got out, didn't it? Oh, real quick. You know, they're trying to all check. I'm going to try to do it. Oh, we're going to shot it. Can I get him? Yep. That's all right. Where do you make of all this going on? Well, we're coming to you live right here at 1100 South Ocean Boulevard here in Palm Beach, Florida. This is Donald Trump's billion dollar home. Uh, and the problem is, from what I understand, the FBI just came over here and they seized the the uh, property here. Now, the Democrats have been nothing but trouble, all right? They've been trying to get Donald Trump on Russian collusion. They've been trying to get him on everything under the sun. You know why? Because they're terrified of Donald Trump. 
They're terrified of the fact that he is a real leader, he's a real president, and from day one, the Democrats have done everything to obstruct him, everything to vote him down, everything to try to get him in prison. When you, when you heard that the FBI was here and raided the place, what went through your mind? I said, it's just typical Democrat. This is a typical Democrat. They have weaponized the FBI. Now, the FBI has but they refuse to go after that because of the company, all of the Biden crime family, all the way from Comey to the rest of them with the Russian collusion and all the phony stuff. But nobody cares. So this doesn't surprise you. This doesn't surprise me. It's just another thing for Donald Trump. But let me tell you something. Just like Donald Trump is a survivor, Donald Trump is a billionaire. He owns the biggest house on the biggest side of town with the long limousines, the jet airplanes, and the Marine ones, of course, the Sea King helicopter pad that was in his backyard, okay? And they have tried over and over. They couldn't get nothing on the January 6th. They're trying to pin it all on him. So now they got to come in here. And from what I understand, they tried to see, they seized his safe in there. Now, the only thing he has in that safe would be the list of members of Mar-a-Lago. So now I wouldn't be surprised they're going to go after every member of Donald Trump, all right, to go after them to find out who they are, where they're from, what Wake they're... Up, that's what's going oh, on. That's right. Hey, we're what, what, what do you make of all the people that are coming out? Well, everybody's saying no, that's right. We, we actually were on the other side. We saw some Democrats out there acting like banshees. All right, they're savage animals. They are savage beasts, those Democrats. But, but who are these people here these that are, are the, Well, a lot of these people are Trump supporters Trump. because they know what's going on. Yeah, yeah. They know yeah. Republicans, yeah. while we sit out here in United States of American flags, <laughs> sipping champagne, all right, the Democrats, they want to social. They love Bernie Sanders. They love idiots like Joe Biden. Okay, I, I got to stay on subject. I got to stay on subject. subject. Can I get your name? <laughs> Mr. Sunshine, Eddie Shippick. That's Eddie Shippick. S-H-I-P-E-K. And E-D-D-I-E. 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 What town? Are you, where are you live? Okay, what town? I actually own four condos here in Palm Beach. Okay, you're in Palm Beach. Yeah. All right, Eddie, I appreciate it. All right, thanks so much. <laughs> I'm so I, I'd be surprised if Comey's here. You know, where's Comey? Where's Where's FBI Comey? Huh? He couldn't get nothing done with the Russian collusion. Maybe he's here. Maybe he's in here opening up the safe. So now you see it. That's the way it goes. You understand? They're planting the evidence in there. That's right. I don't put nothing past the FBI. They are the biggest group. They're like Gestapo. They are the Nazi Gestapo. All right, they will plant evidence. Those FBI agents, they're they're lower than dirt, okay? We saw it for five years throughout all of the Russian collusion. They couldn't get nothing done there. They found him innocent. Trump did nothing wrong, but the Democrats aren't happy with that. They're not happy with that. They, they're terrified of Donald Trump. They need to get rid of Donald Trump, all right? Because they want to stay in power they're passing trillion dollar packages. That money is not going for infrastructure. That money is not going for infrastructure. It is going for re-election of the Democratic Party. This is all private property to grass. Oh, okay. okay. So we're going to get ready to go. This is the street. All right, so we're staying out. You can't stand here either because you're obstructing. Oh, okay. So you can walk and walk, walk back and forth, but you cannot stand. Oh, can't stand. Okay, we can do that. The there we go. Look at it. The FBI That's agents. Right. So we can walk down. I'm going to get some exercise. Right here, right here. This piece right here. All right, we're gonna walk down and walk back. You wanna walk? Should we walk down and walk take back? You don't want to take anybody in. You want a little exercise? You had enough? Let's go. Oops, sorry. So there you have it. Now they want to get. They want you to leave now. All right. This is what they want. See, they want you to. They want us to leave because they know the truth. All right. FBI Comey could be in there right now trying to plant evidence, all right? But I know what they're doing. I know what they're doing. They're looking for the members list of mar lago That's what they're doing right now, okay? They're looking for the members list, and they will go to every house, every address. Listen to this. Now, he can get a ticket. They actually have law. You're not allowed to play music uh, here. So there we go. Oh my God, I'm surprised Kid Rock is playing 
the music here. All right, so what we're going to do. So there you have it. All right. Uh, you, you see my views on what's going on. I've been here for 20-something years. Uh, my, my aunt and uncle been here since the 50s. I know the game better than anybody, okay? And when you got a guy like Donald Trump, a hardcore Democrat, a hardcore Republican who hates Democrats, and you can see the evil, the evil vindictive to weaponize the FBI, all right, in order to push their agenda. No more different than the German Nazi Gestapo, all right? The Gestapo is right here in the FBI here in Palm Beach, Florida today. They found some liberal Democratic judge to sign off on a warrant, and that's, look at this, he ain't stopping. Look at this guy, he ain't stopping. Yeah, so that's what we got going. It is a real shit show here. So what we're gonna do right now, So that was Channel 12 News. So if you turn on Channel 12 News, they probably gonna delete everything. Oh, they're gonna delete all of that. They don't wanna hear that. No. That was a great interview. Was that a good interview? I, I got Sell it Sell it the way it is. That, it did you see a teleprompter? Is there a <laughs> teleprompter? Was I reading a statement? Huh? Did I look like um, Joe Biden sitting there reading with my eyes going No. I tell it the way it is, okay? Mr. Sunshine knows the game better than anybody. All right, so now we're going to take one more ride through. All right, let's get back. The FBI is here at Donald Trump's Mar-a-Lago. They're planting evidence that we already know. They broke into the safe. They want the list of members, all right? Well, let me tell you something. Russian collusion didn't work. All right, January 6th didn't work. So now they got to come to the billion dollar home to try to find something. Okay, there we go. There's the, oh boy. This is a real shit show here at 1100 South. Look at this guy. Hey. Hey, hey, how you doing, buddy? Hey, hey, hey. <laughs> that wave that fucking hey, what are you doing? Look at this. Look at this. That's the guy that threw his hands up. Like, what are you doing? Well, guess what? You got over 100 people here now. Why don't you go out there and tell some of these guys? Huh? Yeah. You see, they didn't want to go out here. That guy, that big bad FBI Nazi Gestapo guy. See, they're good in gangs. If you got a gang of them, oh yeah, they'll they'll night stick you and beat you down. But if you got one of them with a hundred guys, he's gonna stand there like a fucking idiot. Yeah, yeah. Go go tell these guys. Throw your hands up and say, "What are you doing here?" Huh? They'll put you on Channel 12 News, like way I put. You. Oh, look at this. They got him locked up here. Look at this. Oh, boy. They're seizing all the way around. They've got the whole place surrounded. I'm telling you. Yeah, we heard five years of Russian collusion. We heard the bombshell. The bombshell. And guess what? Nothing. And then we heard January 6th, the insurrection. The, they, uh, Democrats don't even know what the word insurrection is. They don't know what the word insurrection is. But if you say it enough, if you keep repeating it, like chanting it. Where, are you, you leaving or are you sticking around? I'm going to stick around. All right, I'm going to stick around too. If you chant, if you chant it long enough, just like Adolf Hitler and Goebbels, if you repeat it long enough, you'll believe it. All right, so keep saying insurrection, insurrection, insurrection. There was no insurrection. They don't even know it. They make the terminology insurrection, all right? They make it for what they want to make it. They want to tell you the definition to, for their narrative. Well, there is no insurrection, okay? They can't stand the fact. Look at this. There you go. They're not going to take it anymore. Yep. So there you have it. There it is, Donald Trump's Mar-a-Lago, the billion dollar home, surrounded by police, infested, infested with the Gestapo of America. That's right, the Gestapo of America. All right, the FBI is what we got going on here. Listen to this, we got it all going on here. There you have it. There you go, Trump, there he is. He's just riding back and forth. Kid Rock, 
you got it all going on here. But you can see how wild, you can see how wild the Democratic Party is. They're wild animals. They're animals. No question about it. There you go. But uh, that's right, Aaron. They stole it because they don't want everything. They don't want to work for it. They want a free ride. They want a free ride. Jameson. Oh, Jameson Hinsley. Uh, Jameson, you must be one of them social. You hate this shirt, don't you? You hate America. You want that socialism lifestyle. I bet you you and Bernie Sanders are like this. Huh? And Joe Biden. Here, I'm going to give you a little view of Joe Biden. Is this what Joe Biden looks like? Where do I go? What do I say? See, that's what you Democrats like. Idiots. You like idiots. You like dummies like Bill Biden that don't even know where they're at. All right? Whoever his handlers are, they ought to be arrested for abuse of the elderly. He shouldn't even be in office. And can you imagine? He's in charge of the football of the nuclear war. Can you imagine? If there was a time that Russia and China should invade, they'd be invading right now and Biden would be like, what do I do? What do I do? Where, 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 where do I go? Where do I stay? Hey, I fucking idiots. Those Democrats, I swear to God, they are the biggest fucking bunch of idiots I've ever seen. All right. You got the Gestapo FBI weaponizing. You know, and that, hey, this is just the start. This is just the start guarantee, of the. I guarantee you they're planting bugs in there. Oh, yeah. They're planting bugs in there. They're, cha they're, they're putting hidden cameras in Mar a Lago right now. They, and guess what? It's going to be guys just. It's going to be guys just like, where was it, Jameson Hinsley. When they come to your house and those Gestapo agents grab you and maybe grab you by the nuts and rip them off and you're going to be standing going, I, 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 I. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Guess what? Go cry to your Democratic pals over there. All right. That's what I like. That's what I like. Cam Sother, Cindy Nicholson, Susan Gentile. You know, Susan, we are getting a real good look at what the Democratic Party is all about. Gestapo, Nazis, all right? They are a police state. They're Nazis, and uh, they're in here at the billion-dollar home of Donald Trump. Now, they, and I know what they're getting. They went into the safe. They're trying to find the members list. They want the list of members that come to Donald Trump to enjoy the champagne, enjoy the beautiful company, the beautiful grounds, all right? Democrats don't want that. All right, trillions of dollars, and they're just, they're, I don't see infrastructure. I don't see nothing being built. The only thing I see is getting reelected. All right, they're taking all those trillions of dollars for reelections. All right, that's the way it is. You know, I know that's the way it's going to go. That's right. Uh, Raymond, that's right. Joe Biden stands there like a freaking idiot, a typical Democrat, a typical Democrat, standing there like a fucking zombie. Ooh. Uh, where do I go? Uh, where do I go? Uh, what do I read? If somebody said, Biden, you're a piece of shit, he would read that right off the teleprompter because he doesn't even know what he's reading. OK, it's just amazing. So that tells me he's not in charge. Who's ever writing the story on the teleprompter is the one in charge. OK, they're the one. He's only just a stupid figurehead that knows nothing else but what to do. All right. So I'm getting pounded here. Well, Joseph, you know what, Joseph, me and a one Robert Abramson. OK, if there's something going to happen in Palm Beach, Florida. All right. You know, Robert, we can look look behind you, Robert. We can look at the skyline of West Palm Beach, Florida. OK, we could look at the Intracoastal. We could talk about Cafe. El Europe. We could go to the band. Beautiful women. We go do that all day long. All right. But when there's something going on, listen to this. Listen to this. With the big boy. Look at this guy. He's coming in. The cavalry is coming. United States of America. There it is. That's right. Susan says, hello, Robert. Hey, hello, Susan. Hey, Susan. Go. He's all man right there. Right? That's all beefcake right there. All beefcake. Well, let me tell you. Right now, it's a, it's a sad day for America. You know, they're treating him like Jeffrey Epstein. 
You know, remember when they came in and Pretty raided? Worse. They're worse than Jeffrey. Jeffrey Epstein was a child molester. All right. They raided his house over there in Palm Beach. As a matter of fact, his house is right down there. All right. Right on the water. Uh, Jeffrey Epstein's mansion that's now bulldozed over. Uh, Todd Michael Glazier bought the property, bulldozed the house, building a brand new mansion. Okay. But right now, as we speak, while Trump is up in Bedminster, New Jersey, at his golf course, which he owns several around the world, all right, uh, they are here raiding his house. And you can be rest assured that they're uh, looking for the members list. They're probably putting microphones throughout the entire property, okay? They're doing everything because they can't get nothing. They, the, the Russian collusion failed. They, they lost out on January 6th. The Democrats know they're not going to get nothing there. So we got to go in and dig, tear up his house. We got to, and guess what, people? They're going to come to your house. This is just the beginning. If they can come into a billion dollar home, all right, imagine what they're going to do to you. You got to read up on German Nazi Gestapo tactics. Well, the Democrats, are, there you go. There you have it right there. There you go. There you go. You got them all going on here. Look at this guy with, with the signs back there. What's that? Look at the guy with the signs. Yeah, yeah. There you go. You got it. You can see what's going on here. Joseph, let me tell you something. Don't be surprised. Don't be surprised if that fucking Gestapo FBI come knocking on my door, okay? They're going to say, Sunshine, you shouldn't be telling them, the FBI, that we're a bunch of Gestapo agents. Well, you are. I'm not lying. It's the truth. Look what they're doing over here. You found some liberal judge to go in and sign some fucking warrant to come in here and grab everything that you can out of a billion-dollar home, uh, and, and they don't care. Democrats love it. They're foaming at the mouth. You know what? Democrats right now, and there was a couple of them on Facebook earlier, they're foaming at the mouth like rabid dogs. All right? They're rabid dogs right now. Saying, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, they got Trump now. Well, I heard that about five years ago, huh? Oh, Russian collusion. I heard that. Huh? Oh, yeah, they got him now. Oh, Russian collusion. Well, let me tell you something, my friends. I know Russian women better than Putin does. If it comes to Russian women here in Palm Beach County, I'm the Putin here. All right, I know the word da and net and tovarich, whoa, better than anybody, okay? So if we're gonna talk about Russian collusion, you don't have to look any further than what you're looking at right now, okay? When you're talking about going into someone's house, like a Gestapo of the German Nazi era and tearing it apart, looking for whatever, all right? I don't know of any dead bodies that Donald Trump murdered and laid in the backyard. I don't know of any embezzlement. I don't know of any Chinese collusion. They should be at Hunter Biden's house, but that will never happen. That will never happen, okay? Because Hunter Biden and the Biden crime family, they're off limits, okay? That $5 trillion, all right, that they got by voting, it's all being paid out. To everybody i know what they're doing i know the game all right pay off the fbi go ask james comey go ask comey go ask ray they asked ray the other day hey what's going on with uh, uh hunter biden oh nothing no we're, we're, nothing's going on with him you mean with uh, the computer oh no we don't want to talk about the computer no we don't talk about that well, what about all the millions and millions of dollars that he, oh, well, we, we don't want to talk about that. We're, we're going to go look for Trump. We're going to dig up Mar-a-Lago, all right? We're going to find something. And those fucking Democrats, those fucking Democrats, those Gestapo agents, they will, they're probably in here planting stuff right now. They're drilling in the walls. They're probably busting out the pillars, trying to find something. All right, the phones are tapped right now. They're doing everything. And that's what you people in America have to look forward to. That's what, you, it starts at a billion dollar home. Imagine what it's gonna to do to your home. Okay, what do you think they're gonna do? If those Gestapo agents will go into a billion dollar home, 
They cost a billion dollars. What are they going to do to your place? Exactly. Huh? What are they going to do? They're going to come in there 10 deep, all right? And they're going to say, well, you know what? Look at look what we just found. We just found 10, 10 pounds of cocaine that the guy, the agent, just brought in and left on the day. We've seen it before, all right? Did this surprise me? No, it don't surprise me, all right? It's just another typical Democratic, the, the Democratic leadership all right, and how desperation, how, can you imagine being that terrified of a guy like Donald Trump? They are terrified. They don't even, you ought to be terrified of Xi. How about Xi? How about Putin? How about, they're, they're not afraid of them. How about North Korea? No, they're afraid of Donald Trump. Well, let me tell you something. We can't have him running. We can't have Donald Trump as president, but we'll, we'll deal with Chinese, uh, Chinese Xi because, you know, Biden paid him off. And uh, Hunter Biden and them are like this, all right? They're all doing, you know what? Hunter Biden's doing a circle jerk. They're doing a circle jerk with the Chinese government. They're all doing circle jerks. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you Democrats, that's how you do things, all right? That's how you do things, circle jerking. And the FBI agents over there, the Gestapo, they're doing their circle jerk over there, okay? So let them do what they want, Donald Trump, all right? You, you don't want, they didn't go to Bedminster? If anything, wouldn't you think they would go to Bedminster, where he's at? Why would you come down to his billion dollar home? They want, harassment. They strictly harassment. Before the midterms. All right, you remember, all right, before the midterms, all right, where Donald Trump endorsed every candidate as one yep. across the board, and now they're terrified. Those Democrats are like, oh my God. Oh my God, every person that Donald Trump endorsed as an intelligent, look at it, who's that in the boat? Who's that in the boat? Look at this. Oh no, that's a car. I thought that was a boat. There, there they are out there in the property. There it is. Look, they're parading around the, the, the backyard of Donald Trump. They're, they're, they're checking out the backyard. Look at it right there. There it is. Now, I've been over there for 20 years. I know the game at Trump's mansion. All right, I was there before he was president and uh, things are happening over there. So there you go. That's what you have right there right now. All right, the Democratic Party at its finest right now. All right, look at all the lights are on over there too. Where'd he go? They actually have the lights on. They're actually working inside there planting more evidence i'm sure they're doing everything they can to find they couldn't get nothing on russian collusion they couldn't get nothing on january 6 so now they got to go in there and try to get the members list of mar-a-lago so they can find out who's coming who's going how much they're donating how's it drinking what champagne they're looking through the kitchen for beluga caviar. They're to the point that if there's even Russian caviar, they're going to bring back Russian collusion, okay? That's the way it's going to go. That's what's happening here. We actually have helicopters. There's the helicopter back here. It was here earlier today, uh, whether that is an FBI or a news. Um, it didn't have any news uh, written on the outside earlier, so it could just be an FBI helicopter flying around. Uh, observing from the aerial because there would they wouldn't be uh, news crab filming at night uh, they wouldn't be able to see anything so uh, more than likely it is a uh, FBI federal helicopter flying around up there but uh, there you can see all the lights on over there as they're dissecting the mansion they're dissecting the Mar-a-Lago tonight looking for everything they can now over here to the west you can see the skyline of downtown West Palm Beach. Uh, that's Okeechobee Bridge over there. We are on the Southern Boulevard Bridge. Look at this, boy. Now that's no news film up there. The news, there's nothing for them to see. Plus he's right in the flight line. Yeah, he's right in the flight line. That is the FBI right there. That's an FBI helicopter uh, overseeing the night shift. Just to rack up the bill, okay? They're just racking up the bill. All right. We need everything here. We need helicopters flying around. Look at this, huh? The Nazi Gestapo, the Gestapo, German Gestapo is today's FBI. All right, there it is right there. Look at this. 
Look, he's flying sideways. He's flying sideways. He's not. Yeah, he's a, he's actually flying in circles. All right. Well, he used to fly that way with the Robinson, That's why right? I flew with my right. That's right. I was a helicopter pilot. Robinson R22, R44. I know that Robinson inside and out. I'd make that. I made that Robinson dance up there. Okay. I'd fly down here from from uh, Fayette County down here to North Palm Beach Airport. But there you have it. They are circling around. That is more than likely an FBI helicopter uh, with the uh, Gestapo inside there of Mar-a-Lago. Well, you know, Joseph, let me tell you something, Daddy. We've got Sean Hannity. Sean Hannity lives less than a mile down the road at Sloan's Curve. He bought a townhouse over there. Uh, I believe Laura Ingram or one of the other girls uh, from Fox News, they live there at Sloan's Curve, which is just about a year down. So uh, you got a lot going on here. Um, I don't see Sean Hannity here, and I don't see Laura Ingram, but you do see Mr. Sunshine and Robert Abramson here. Okay. Here. I don't see Leo here. Leo's not here. Not no, Leo. Le Le Leo's been put out to pasture. Leo's All right. For signs. Leo, <laughs> that's right. Yeah. So there you have it. Look at that. The mar lago under siege by the FBI uh, here in Palm Beach, Florida. This is live. This is not a videotape. This has been a long video. I don't know how long this has been on. That's right, Raymond. Let me tell you something. That's the bottom line. The Democrats are going to cry a river of tears. We've watched them cry during the Russian collusion um, when Mueller... In, in his incapacitated state said they found nothing. They were going to hang him, all right? They were going to hang Mueller for not finding anything. Uh, then the January 6th um, insurrection, which there is no insurrection, all right? They couldn't find nothing here, so now we gotta come in here and dissect this house. We're gonna find something. So there you have it. Look at this, the helicopter still flying around, still circulating looking for what's going on here now for all you democrats out there here we go here we go we got some more making their final round here we got kid rock going on american flag democrats hate the red white and blue they hate america they hate the United States and everything it stands for. They don't want democracy. They don't want capitalism. Those people, they want socialism. They want communism. They want to check every month to sit home and do nothing. All right, like they're doing now. All right, the Democrats want to sit at home and do nothing. All right, and bitch and comply and complain while Donald Trump's uh, people that he has endorsed are winning across the board okay and it's a shame that the democratic party would weaponize the gestapo to go in and start invading people's homes okay there's no reason for that there was nothing the fbi is trying anything to help uh the idiot biden all right they probably got a couple of billion dollars uh, uh a donation i'm sure uh, the five trillion dollars uh, that was there, and plus the other billions and billions that they've just voted for, all right? Uh, most of it probably went to the FBI. That's why they don't want to talk about Hunter Biden. They don't want to talk about Joe Biden. They don't want to talk about anything that's got anything to do with the Democrats, okay? You got the laughing hyena vice president. She's a moron, all right? The most useless vice president in U.S. history, all right? But yet people embrace her. They embrace her they, because they love stupidity. All right, they love losers. They love stupidity. Look at this. He's going back. He's going back right in front of Donald Trump's mansion. He's going back. They're both making their rounds back up there again. The FBI at their machine guns. They're standing outside just like the Gestapo. They're out there with their machine guns watching the door. Secret Service. I uh, had to take a back seat. Here's my back. Running up there. You got the American flag. There's an American right there. there and there he is. Fly that American. Democrats hate that flag. They hate that flag. 
They want communism. They, I see that lady, you see that Democrats? America, all right? Stars and stripes, all right? You stole the election. You know it, I know it, and the world knows it. But you are terrified of Donald Trump. And you know, when you're terrified of Donald Trump, that's the guy who's gotta be the leader, all right? When you're scared of what a man can do, all right? When he owns the biggest house on the biggest side of town with them long limousines, those jet airplanes and the Marine One Sikorsky Sea King helicopter pad that was in his backyard. When you're afraid to get to this level, then you know he's got to be the guy. He's the man. Love it or hate it. Learn to live with it because he's the best thing going today. All right. So there you have it. That's right. They don't want to hear about those riots. That's what Democrats love. They love rioting. They love looting. They love, the they love, you know what, you know what Democrats love? Democrats love Louis Vuitton because they can't work to afford one. So we go and steal one. Okay. If you can't afford a Rolls Royce, the Democrats will go into a Rolls Royce dealer and steal one. All right. That's what they specialize in because they feel, hey, I don't have to work for it because the Democratic Party will, won't put me in jail. They'll just let me go. All right. Well, you know what? We all look in disgust. We all look and shake our head because that's the reality of what America has come from. You're not going to see this. You're not going to see this on NBC or CNN. You're not going to see this. You're going to see it live here, all right? The FBI, the Gestapo, the German Gestapo is now the FBI of the United States of America, okay? There it is. That's right. So you can see they weaponized Comey, Ray, and uh, uh, under, F, under uh, investigation there, uh, FBI leader Ray, uh, we're not, we can't talk about uh, Hunter Biden. Uh, we can't talk about Joe Biden. We can't talk about, they can't talk about anything. Ongoing investigation. Ongoing investigation. That's what it is. All right. I plead the fifth. Ongoing investigation. We can't talk about Hunter Laptop. All right. Now that, now that two years has gone by and the elections are coming up, we can't talk about it because that'll, that'll jeopardize the Democratic Party uh, in their voting. Look at this. We've got another one going back here. So there you have it. It's been a long night. I think I'm going to wrap it up. You got anything more you want to say? You want to tell the, tell the whole Facebook listener audience anything? No, it's, it's a sad day in America. It's a sad day in America. This is history. It's, it's in America. Right That's right. Now, let's see. We're going to get you with the background of the West Palm Beach skyline. And here he is, ladies. That's all man right there. I really want to thank you. You text me because you told me. I was already on my way, but I saw you come. Ladies, love it or hate it, learn to live with it. What you're looking at right here is the best news crew going today. We're gonna That's tell it fact. the way. We're gonna tell it the way it is. We we don't sugarcoat nothing. No, we're not no sugarcoating. No teleprompters. I don't have no script in front of me. Nobody's telling me what to say. I don't have an earpiece in here. All right. I don't even have wax in my ears. Okay. There ain't no teleprompter and there ain't nobody telling me. Hey, say this and say it. I'm not saying nothing. I'm telling the truth. All right. So there you have it. I hope you're all going to have a great day. Uh, coming to you live, reporting from Palm Beach, Florida, Mr. Sunshine and his co-host, Mr. Robert Abramson. Thank you for watching.